Okay, Cancer, you are up. Um, so this, these readings this week are about the um, new moon in Scorpio, because I know a lot of people were a little concerned with it. Um, so far, readings are looking good, so let's hope that you also have a, a decent reading today, okay? All right, Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising, what would you like them to know for the new moon in Scorpio? New Moon and Scorpio, what would you like them to know? And I know that, that some of you guys have requested me do a reading on something else. I cannot remember. So, you know, when I go live this week, I'm going to try to cover all the signs um, based on whatever it is somebody requested. I, I'll look back at, at the messages and figure it out. So I do apologize. I'm a little scatterbrained. Um, you know, um... Uh, I'm not a very organized person, you know, at all. So I do apologize to anybody that's like wondering what I'm even doing because I don't even know what I'm doing. Cancer, sun, moon, and rising. Cancer, sun, moon, and rising. Who is Scorpio, new moon? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. You may be going through some sort of heartbreak, Cancer, during this period of time. Um, it looks like, you know, even though the passion is gone, the emotions are still stuck. So. Sun, moon, and rising. I feel like this would have been a long time going as well for some reason. Else it was a long-term commitment or it was just a long like it's been a long time that you've been dealing with this. Um, so we do have a possibility of reconciliation here, Cancer. Let me ask what this is about. Reconciliation for Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising during the Scorpio New Moon. Somebody out there is having twins. Doesn't have to be you. It could be somebody you know. Looks like it'd be twin boys, but take it as it resonates. No. 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 Um, for those of you that there was a third party situation, that person is not gone. Okay? For those of you that this is... Um, some sort of financial issue, you you guys were all going through the financial issue is still there okay um somebody may have even changed jobs or lost a job okay cancer sun moon and rising what would you like them to know for the new moon in scorpio need to make a decision you need to make a decision um it looks like it looks like your money is sort of on hold again i don't know if you're changing jobs if you're you know um looking at a new career path uh just having you know you know coming out of pocket for some some reason you know I feel like a lot of you guys are making a decision, you know, and it's, and it's like not an easy decision. We have the hangman here. You're really trying to make sure it's the right decision, but for a lot of you, it's going to be a move. Um, could even be to a foreign area, a place you are not used to. You and your person are in the reverse. If you do not have a person, um, I don't see you meeting anybody soon. Cancer, sun, moon, and rising. Cancer, sun, moon, and rising. Jeez, Cancer, you are going through it. We do have another person here that will be popping up around this time. Um, this could be somebody 
doesn't have to be a romantic situation. This is just somebody popping up that um, dealt with a very heavy situation. Okay. I don't know if you knew that they did. I don't know if you um, heard that they did. If you are around, it doesn't feel like you were even around when they did. I don't know. But um, but it looks like they lost something very important to them. It was very emotionally heavy and burdensome. Um, you'll hear from them when things, when they're at their lowest, basically, when they just can't take it anymore, okay? Cancer, sun, moon, and rising. That's giving me a sister vibe, but it doesn't have to be, okay? So just, like, it's just giving me that feeling. Cancer, sun, moon, and rising. Some of you are waiting on somebody to else make a change or to have some sort of growth. Um, I don't see that happening anytime soon. Just keep that in mind. If this is you that you're waiting on some sort of change and growth with, it's going to be a very slow process, especially when it comes to your income. I think the majority of you may take a job that is not like fulfilling just to get by for a little while um, or end up taking a new job that you end up not really enjoying, uh, but it's temporary once again, okay? You've pulled Pisces twice, Cancer, for some reason, so I do feel like there is a Pisces in your life right now. Um, if that's true, they're not in a good place. What is the three of coins here? What is the three of coins here? Yeah, see, so a lot of you, like I said, are going to start a new project, a new job, a new whatever it is, and it's not gonna, it's like you celebrate because you get it or because it gives you the ability to move or right? because it gives you the ability to just freaking eat every day, but the celebration isn't really like ideal, right? This isn't something you really wanted um, to do. So with that, we do have the world, you know, something else is going to happen. This is not, this is not a forever situation. Tell me more for Cancer, Sun, Moon and Rising, please. Um, somebody feels bad about what they did to you. This would have been something from the past. Some, I do expect them to come in with sort of like an olive branch to you. I do. I'm still seeing children, Cancer. So I don't know if you have children or somebody around you is going to be having children. Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising. I do expect somebody to have some sort of explosive blowout um, after this um, new moon. Could be a fire sign. If it's not a fire sign, it's somebody. They feel a lot younger than you, but it, take it as it resonates. This person is... Ooh, like they've got um they've got a temper this person is very heated okay and I do feel like you're gonna be the one to sort of like put on your armor and deal with it appropriately um calm the storm and so that's really good Cancer, sun, moon, and rising. Cancer, I do feel like you're really ready for something better. You're really ready to not just give your heart to somebody, but like to make your life what you want it to be. 
Um, what else are we getting here? I'm sorry, I'm super congested today. I really do appreciate, uh, apologize. Those, those romantic situations, guys, that did not or are not working out for you, okay? Especially with this new moon, okay? Because the new moon is supposed to be an ending. It's supposed to be, like, uh, detaching. It, like, for a lot of people, it's going to be angry and hostile or whatever. But at the end of the day, it's really in our best interest. And I, and a lot of you guys are done with a very turbulent emotional situation, okay? And that's okay. Like, drop it. With the Four of Wands, it's telling me you're heading in the right direction. But but you're also heading in that direction with some hurt and resentment. Um, and that's okay, too. But I see uh, everybody so far has pulled this card, which is awesome. And I feel like this is the Scorpio New Moon card, It like, for the week. It's like everybody's contemplating, finding hope changing setting new boundaries um healing from you know things that were done to them and i really love it i love that everybody's pulling that card it's fantastic what else do we want cancer to know sun moon and rising with this new moon in scorpio somebody plays else like lacrosse or something of that nature i don't know why i'm seeing that Taking care of yourself now that you're kind of like willing to see people for who they really are. Um, somebody's going vegetarian or vegan. Looks vegetarian, but could be vegan. Or is. Somebody might get news. Ooh, this is good. This is good. You might hear from somebody you know or somebody you're acquainted to um, about a new job opportunity or business opportunity going forward. And um, as long as you really are like in it, as long as you're really ready to put your best foot forward, I feel like it would be really successful for you. Um, I see you signing some sort of contract, shaking hands. This is a quiet person. They really kind of t took you under their wing. It's good. It's good. I like it, Cancer. I like it. With the justice, I feel like you're getting what you deserve now. You know, as hard as it is to move forward, you're getting what you deserve. And money is going to start looking better in the future as well. Lots of possibilities for new adventures. Um, typical, typical cancer going a little bit hermit while you're dealing with your um, changes and whatnot. And that's okay. Like even, even as a Pisces, I do that, you know, I just cut out from everybody until I get my stuff together again. And I think that that's, I think that's good. I think it's positive, actually. I think it's healthy to, to do that, you know, to recoup. Let's get two more cards and that's it. I'm going to end it here, Cancer. This this looks pretty good. I'm feeling really good about everybody's reads today. Okay. Leaving certain people behind, especially when it comes to business, whether you own a business, this is a boss, whatever, um, just know leaving isn't going to go well. They're not going to want to lose you, okay? Um, do it for you. Do it for you because the end result is going to be a much better place for you, um, not just, you know, um, financially but otherwise okay so I really think that again if you're in a situation where you're saying goodbye to business or people and and somebody's really angry and fighting and bitter about it just know that you needed to let go of this person like you it, you really needed to let go of this situation okay you don't need that kind of confrontational and they're just taking it very personally and it's not really personal you know 
So anyway, Cancer, um, the la card on the end of at the bottom of the deck is death, which is change. And I think that the change going forward for you guys is going to be really positive. 